Good morning, afternoon and evening everyone and welcome to episode 1 of Resident Evil 2's Leon B scenario on the N64. We're continuing the story that we started with Claire. Uh, we've seen half of the ending and to piece the whole story together you basically have to play both scenarios. So we'll jump straight into it. That's gonna be Leon B scenario second. Oh yeah, we'll also in see the, the other side of the intro. Virus outbreak in Raccoon City. Claire Redfield succeeded in escaping from the city, along with one of the only other survivors. A young girl named Sherry. He means Sherry. However, behind their escape, was the lone survivor of the Raccoon City Police Department. Leon S. Kennedy. No, oh, he said S actually, sounded like an S, not like an S. No one on the road. Just in case you didn't know where we are, we're in Raccoon City. What have we got here? Look at that robot chicken animation. Let's see what happened to the trucker again. I do believe, believe we get to see the uh, uh, this gas station if it's the same one in Resident Evil 3. Man, what a mess! What could have done this? What could have done this? What, what are these things? I honestly love Leon's intro a lot better than Claire's. No! Let me jump on you. What's up with that guy? That was a clean. They must be on drugs, Leon. Arrest the fuck out of them. You shot him. We can't stay out here. Head to the police station. It'll be a lot safer. <laughs> there. Okay. What's going on? I arrived in town. And the whole place went Great. insane. The radio's out. You're a cop, right? Yeah. First day on the job. Great, huh? Name's Leon Kennedy. Nice to meet you. Mine's Claire. Claire Redfield. I came to find my brother, Chris. But Chris is nowhere to be found. Hey, could you open the glove box? Sure. There's a gun inside. Better take it with you. Yeah, we'll comment on all of this in the in clear scenario. So he did fly out straight, okay? yeah. Still in one piece. I should check if the car turns differently in this version when you're playing the Leonate scenario. Shaboom! <laughs> Flying Leon. Claire! Leon! I'm okay. Head to the 
station. I'll meet you there. Okay. All right. I haven't played this scenario in a long time. So just ignore those guys. There should be a file somewhere nearby. An EX file. Perhaps an extra file. I don't know. No. Let me read. What's wrong with you stopping education and whatnot? There we go. Mercenaries log. So this is also, I think all the EX files are from Resident Evil 3 Nemesis, except for maybe one or two. September 1st, since this is a mercenary, we have to give him a tough voice. Following six months of intensive training, my body's edge has returned. It was a good, I was a good soldier, but they ordered my execution with no reason given. I was tortured and forced to give a false confession. But on the morning of my execution, a miracle happened. The company had helped me out, giving me a second lease of life. September 15th. I ended my vacation short and returned to the HQ office. It looks like my UBCS unit's been called into action. Umbrella maintains its own paramilitary unit to counter corporate terrorism and VIP abduction. In addition, they have nightmen who specialize in handling problems caused by illegal products. I'm currently a member of the latter. September 28th. Dawn's here, but we're still slogging, slogging, slogging through this nightmare. There are no provisions of any kind here. The undead walk the streets, feeding upon the flesh of the living. Given the choice again, I would have rather, I would, I would rather have been executed. Death Row was a heavenly asylum compared to this place. I've chosen to pull the trigger myself in the hope that my dead body won't come back to life. And no three dots. That guy was serious. He wasn't fucking around. No time for ellipses. You know shit's real. Screw you guys. I'm going to the station. Okay, I should check my inventory. I don't even know what I have. Pistol and a knife. Well, at least he's got some more ammo. And the pistol is H. H&K VP-70, manufactured by H&K Germany. It uses 9mm nine mm parabellum rounds. Not sure if that's a real gun. Like, I'm not sure. I know they use, like, real names in Resident Evil 1. I'm not sure if that applies here as well. Quickly! Cabin key, alright. Nothing else here, no, just ignore them. One chumps me. Oh, I can do this. Come on. Yeah! I'm faster than that. They are. And that guy's guarding the door. He's still <laughs> clinging to his life duty. Uh, duty. <laughs> I didn't check the key though. But it's only if you want to be a real perfectionist. Alright. Yes. I'll take that. I'll also take that. So now we know where we are uh, in the police station or the surrounding areas. Because we've been here as Claire and now that. So they just broken the gate and if I try opening the door, uh, I'll get this, probably the same animation that Claire had with them going in. But I'm not going to risk it and try not to drag on too much. I think six hours is an okay time. I mean, yes, you can do it in like three or two, but that's just like too much. Okay, can I go around that guy? Maybe. I'm, oh, nope. I can at least push him. Ammo is valuable. I think there's a guy over there as well. And no herbs, I, w I believe. I can go down and uh, go back down and check. But first this. Hey, get over here! Hurry! I can't sit her down. I'll drop you a rope ladder. Grab on to it. Come on. Just a little more. Get off me! Stay back! Don't come any closer! Stay back! How did that not work? And hit the pilot. <laughs> Super dramatic evil to uh, 
at least it killed the zombies along with the uh, well the guys who would have been zombified anyway at least the pilot who got shot well the guy who got eaten would also be zombified so is there something here no there isn't okay screw that then we don't need to go back there anymore but there's a surprise to the B scenario in form of a giant Hulkin a Russian trench coat uh, killing machine. You all know what I'm talking about. Okay, yeah, that's the same. So we need to find the valve, which is now in the uh, western office on the first floor. By the way, the guy who just got killed, uh, the policeman, he's, I think he's not David Ford, but the other guy. Edward? Edward? Something like that. And no crows? No. And he's... Wait, what? So according to this, Claire's already been here and crows have flown out. Which shouldn't be, you know. Because it took her a lot long, you know, a lot longer to get here. But we're not gonna... They just pick the crows off one by one. One peck. Oh, my eyes, my beautiful eyes. I have beautiful eyes. Come on. Okay, run towards them so you can see where they are. One down and we're waiting for this one to fly and blah. Okay, not so bad. At least the crows are done and he's still fine. Two packs in the eye, eyes, and the zombie chomp, and he's like shrugging it off. Fuck that shit. Take his ammo. That's the smart thing to do. I think there are liquors in the next room, so I'll just quietly check and then retreat. Oh yeah, I just, I think I just remembered where we find the second floor map, which bothered me in the first. Yep. Just quietly go back and let them do their business. I don't think they're gonna disappear like the zombies, so... Gotta be crafty about it. Need the shotgun first. Maybe I can just pass... Walk past them. Hmm. Yeah, I don't have the card yet. I need to put out the fire to get the card in the B scenario. And that's not gonna be easy. Plus we don't want a liquor uh, walking away with my head. That would be really unpleasant. I would have to restart from scratch. Come on. At least I can kill a few zombies. Nothing else. Run straight there. Alright, okay, yeah, that works. I can take this. That's good. That guy's still lying there, okay. Die, oh, you bastard. Shotgun would have been really neat here, but I think it's locked in the office. Wow, so many. Jeez, yeah, I don't think this is the smartest for course of action, but I don't have anything else, and like I said, I'm not familiar with the B scenario as much, which is a shame, especially Leon's B scenario. Everybody down? All right, they didn't, less than two clips, that wasn't so bad. You sure you're all dead? Yeah, look at them. All piled up. Alright, what's here? Yeah, okay. We're getting more ammo. That is always valuable. And what do we have here? A red herb maybe? No, green. Okay, I need to find... I need uh, an item box, which... Do I know the floor? Was it like 
4542. Yeah, it's the same code. All right. And the map of the first floor. Okay. Now, where's the shotgun? I think this hole is going to be full to the brim. Let's snoop around here a while. Any files? I don't know. That guy seems awfully close, so I'm not going to go there. It's a trap! It's a trap! Oh my god, it's a fucking trap! Oh no, he's just looking away. That's cool, that's cool. <laughs> he's turning his head like, what? No files here? Do I need to step on him to find out? No. Oh, reading material. Game, give me reading material. I need to read. Four ink ribbons already. Not bad, not bad. I think here or here. Where are you looking, Mia? It doesn't seem like there's much. In fact, it seems there's less than there was in the in the A scenario. So let's see if any. If there's no one on the. I think it's gonna be scary. Ah! Yep. <laughs> Fuck those guys. <laughs> not good. Not good. Okay, okay. So no shotgun and I got a tyrant waiting for me. When I use the valve, so that's not good. I'm pretty sure I can just run around him for now, then return later to bash his ass, but <sighs> tough choices. Let's get another one of these. I'll need to slide my way to the item box somehow. Because nothing else is open and there's that whole horde waiting for me there. So I'm already trapped. I believe it, I believe it was easier with Claire. I think you find the, the grenade launcher somewhere. Uh, but I'm not sure. Maybe it's gonna be... I don't know. Slowly. Oh yeah, I can do this. Okay. They're not too close, so I can avoid them now and later. More ammo. And an appalled diary. Okay, that's feeling safer already. Yeah, it's the same diary we had in the first story, so we don't need to read it for real. Is that a film? Oh, it's a small key. Oh, man. Continuing the tradition of male characters not being able to pick locks for some reason. From Resident Evil 1. I know where some of these should be. Like the, uh, the locks for small keys. Thanks for the follow, uh, Megalonzi. Mega Jonesy. Sorry, I looked like Megalonzi. <laughs> Thanks for the follow, I appreciate it. Alright, so I have shotgun shells, but no shotgun. Pistol, ammo, shotgun, ammo. Then, then. I'm gonna need this. Thanks for the sparks as well. Okay. Are there any liquors on out here? I'm good, man. What about you? Counting down the days to Resident Evil 3. Oh shit, there's a bunch of guys here. Let's see what it looks like. Oh, thank you. Yeah, that's that's the main thing I'm trying to do. I also stream sometimes new games, but old games are old games. They just have a different approach to the whole thing. 
Thanks, man. I appreciate it. Hopefully, I keep you entertained. I never shut up, though. <laughs> That's one thing. <laughs> okay, we got something here. Is that the shotgun? Is that the sh... Oh, let me kiss you. Mwah. Now we can go... Pay a visit to that pesky tyrant. <laughs> pesky ty tyrannical leader. <laughs> oh yeah, we don't have the card, so screw that. Everything's locked. Oh, but I know where the metal is. At least we can do that. And does that do any good here before getting the card? I don't think so. Oh no, no, I'm not like that at all. I, I don't, maybe Metroid once I did that, but normally I just play for, you know, like what you'd play at home in a relaxing atmosphere, taking my time, reading the files, doing the voices, <laughs> that kind of thing. Was this a smart idea? We'll find out. Can I now look, take a look at the other? Hello. Nope. Okay, they're too slow to reach me here. Maybe there's an herb here. Yeah. All right. Bonus herbs are always good. And is there a bread down there? Nope. Okay. Then I don't think there's anything else for Leon outside here. Oh, wait. There's a file. Aha. Uh -huh. Another extra file. Brad's note. Oh, console. Actual Nintendo 64. <laughs> That's one of my points. I don't do emulation, just like sitting on a couch with a controller, rumble pack and all, and just enjoying the game. And it's really hard not finding a good capture card to do that uh, with decent quality on digital streams from interlaced video. But it's working. So I got Brad's note. Brad should have died here. Uh, if we did the whole Brad's uh, key thing in the first episode of Claire A scenario. Yeah, I heard about that. I'm thinking of getting one once the dust settles around what's going on currently. So let's read the Brad's notes. Brad's voice is kind of... Uh, no, it's that monster in the black suit again. Why does the thing keep chasing me? What did I do? This must be some someone's sick idea of a joke. If I knew things were going to no, end up like this, I would have left the stars team a long time ago. I mean, you did, Brad, in the first game. You just ran like a bitch, but okay. But whining won't help me now. I know I'm finished. Dot, dot, dot. Oh, dot, dot, dot. In my hometown, Delusia, I bet the flowers are in bloom. If I could only see them once more before I die. Brad Dickers. And Claire killed him, so it's we're under state of emergency and uh, have a curfew and seniors are forbidden to go out and there are monetary penalties all in the effort to uh, take down the number of victims and we only have like, whoa, those guys are serious. We only have like, I think, 80 infected people, no one dead yet. So I guess their plan is working and, you know, being used to working from home and playing video games, nothing changes really for me. <laughs> yeah, I heard from some of my uh, US clients that things are looking bad there as well. But, you know, hopefully someone finds a vaccine pretty fast and we can resume, you know, normal lives and learn something from this crisis. And I'll just be like, ah, it's over now. We can just keep on fucking around again. Okay, metal or no metal? Yeah, I'm gonna take it. What do you mean? I mean, it just shows the human... what, How people are when... Hey, wait, is that guy there available? What people are like in the time of crisis kind of shows. Wow. Unbelievable. 
Oh, you mean that? Well, geez, we wouldn't. We didn't have that. I mean, people were talking about the virus for a while, and then suddenly it became kind of more critical. And last week they were like, okay, that's it, no more fucking around, everybody back home. People are protesting though. I mean, which is. It's silly to. What are you protesting? Your own health? I don't get it. So they're like, yeah, I'm gonna go out in the streets and cafes are full. And, but hopefully, you know, things come back to normal. As normal as they can get. How many? It sounds like there's a dozen of them. Okay, I need to put out the fire. There's no. There's no avoiding it. Can't even go there because of the electronic lock, so fuck that. Use all the shotgun on the on on the tyrant. And see what happens. I guess the liquors will go away once I put out the fire. Put the fire out. Rather. Sorry to hear that man. That's really irresponsible from the government. Hello, small key. Let me unlock some doors, which are actually drawers. Draw they're for drawers. <laughs> what he got? Just sh oh, yeah, shotgun, magnum, ammo, and then we can dick around with the items. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not putting that away yet. Gonna carry some health on me. Get the last herb there, and that's about it. One more herb. Ammo. Don't forget the ammo. Yeah, exactly that. Ammo. Okay. You should be. Yeah. Uh, I mean, everybody should just like avoid. Sadly, but avoid human touch until, you know, they come up with a solution. Somebody comes up with I keep saying they like it's like a single group of people, but yeah, you know what I mean. Okay, hopefully the liquors will be kind and be like, oh, I'm not seeing you. Oh, thank you, liquor. Slowly, you can't hear my very loud footsteps. <laughs> Oosh. Okay, let's go get that remaining herb. It's gonna need be necessary for when the tyrant decides to bust through the wall. Kool-Aid man his <laughs> himself in. You got the green herb. I mean, if nothing else, he can smoke himself to oblivion. When the tyrant comes, he goes like, Dude, you're green like this herb. Oh, those moanings. Moanings? Moans, rather? I see I s there are some drop frames again. I guess it's some... The internet is overwhelmed with all the people staying at home because that happened yesterday as well. But it didn't happen for a while before that, for like a week or two. Hope the stream is not glitching too much. But whatever the case, the recording's gonna be fine on YouTube because. That's recorded locally, so no like stream issues actually affect it. Alright. Oh yeah. That's good with Streamlabs. I wish the Xbox did that too when you stream on Mixer. Just like record it internally. It has the power. <laughs> we have the technology. We can restream him. Alright. Barbecue's over. Everybody ho. Oh jeez, I thought Tyrant's gonna, yeah, I have mixed memories of the remake now and this, so I'm expecting him to go through that door, but luckily he can chase us around like he can in the remake. Fuck yeah, that's already like 25 shells, 
So that's pretty good. I feel confident. I have two good health items. I'm just gonna pump him full of lead and see what happens. Oh, thanks for the host, man. I appreciate it. It's really nice of you. Spread the word. We're gonna get fucked by a tyrant. T003, I think. Kachu. Shaboo. He fell so close to the exit, but he's gonna walk away, and then when I start walking over there, he's gonna be a bit closer. So let's arm ourselves, switch to the D-pad for precision. Just like crisscross, pray to all the gods, and go kill ourselves a tyrant. Hoo-wee! Okay. And I'm blocked in. What kind of cocksuckery is this? Oh, I can hear his footsteps. Fuck you, guy! I'm gonna get to you first. Ugh. No, move, Leon. He's fast. Oh, he bitch slapped me. Now run. Run, you slow bastard. Okay, I'm just hurt. Not too, too bad. Before he slaps me again, I'm gonna do this. And try to run for my life. All right. Yeah, I can. I think I can lead him all the way to the entrance. Not now. I forgot. There's one bullet. Oh, shell rather. Oh, Jesus. Okay, not too bad. Gone. One more. Yeah. All right. That was epic. That was epic. Come on. Ah. Oh. Fuck yeah. And what do we get? Handgun bullets. 30 handgun bullets. He's not shy with ammo. It's, it's worth killing him. Here. Not in the remake. Don't do it in the remake. We haven't checked the shotgun though. It's a Remington M1100P. Which is like for the cut stock. So it's like a sawed off shotgun. Uses 12 gauge rounds. Smaller than a standard, standard M1100 as its barrel is cut. So yeah, they were still using real we weapon manufacturers. All right, should I use one more green herb? Let's see if there are liquors there still. That was satisfying. So, all in all, nine shells. Some of them were a little further, so I guess they didn't do full damage. But that is pretty neat. I like it. I love it. Oh boy, he's like, hmm, I'm going to shrug that off and just continue doing what I was doing for the past few minutes, but I'm going to do it for a long time. Wow, that music was just so <laughs> suddenly loud for no reason. It exploded in my ears. You're still here. Are you fucking kidding me? Oh. Gotta kill them. They're not gonna go away like the... Uh, like the zombies. Oh well. So I have, I have to kill them to get the card, which sucks. But I have 10 shells, so it should be enough to also take down the horde that's just below me in the hallway. I have one more extra green herb. Yeah, I got it. It's a little harder here, but we'll make it. We had so many herbs at the end of Claire scenario, so I believe it's not going to be too hard here. It's going to be another liquor in the room. Yeah, this is gonna be a little tricky fucky, but we'll think of something. Yeah, let's leave those. Leave that. Bravely move forward. <sighs> Should take, I think, two shells up close to kill a liquor. I'm not sure. But it can also like do the tongue whiplash, which is not pleasant. And they're prone to taking my head off as well, so can I just pass it? Yeah, come back. Yeah, what? Ooh, that was close. Stay down, boy. Yeah, all right. 
Not bad, not bad. Camera served me good. Okay. Feeling more confident. And the guy that jumped to, to swipe me, <laughs> swipe at me? To just walk away with my head? He got fucked. He missed. Sometimes slowdowns are on my side. And sometimes they're not. One more shell left after that. I'm gonna, yeah, I'm, that's gonna be enough space, yeah. Alright, that was good. Just totally made up for the fact that the tyrant bitch slapped me twice. I can move freely again. And he can't actually fix the helicopter. Uh, I mean, the destroy the wall, whatever, fix the helicopter. So yeah, he's not even thinking about using C4, which is kind of backwards if you ask me. He's the policeman and Claire is just a college girl. Why was she handling the C4? To meet the chief, probably. And Leon and chief never meet in this version. Actually, not. In the remake as well. Yeah, that's true. What is that? Secret shells. Fuck yeah. I don't know if the liquor is going to jump in right away or after I take the card. Probably after I take the card. And since I have to return here later, I got to take care of it. See? That's what it is going to crash through. Oh. So nervous. Okay. So we need two of these. Slowly, Leon, we're using the D-pad for precision. You gonna jump in right away? No, when I start walking, that's good. Card key, key card, it's all the same. All right, shotgun's really good, like so much better than the... Uh... Yeah, there we go. He probably can hear me. Don't walk away, you need to be close to him in order to... No! Fuck yeah! Yeah. Go after him. Fuck yeah. So nervous, but it was a good... Avoided him really good. Look at me tooting my own horn. <laughs> Alright, anything else? Wow. They were a lot scarier when I was a kid, I can tell you that. Usually we just stand there and try to pistol kill them. Pistol whip them even. Tyranus the Brave. <laughs> Maybe it's Tyranus the Brave? So 10 shells and wow, that's 102 pistol bullets already. So not bad, scenario B is a little harder, but just gotta stock up and basically do what we do in any Resident Evil game. Can go back to the stick now for a more relaxed experience. And I should clear up the hallway now. The first floor hallway. Also unlock all the doors. There's a lot to do. Three doors will be unlocked, so. Cool, cool, cool. Pistol ammo, shotgun ammo. Okay. Let's just swap these. So it makes more sense when switching weapons. <laughs> switching weapons! Ah. <laughs> Imagine if they made the, uh, what's the name of the gun? The Bane, I think? Yeah, from, from the Borderlands? Cursed. Yeah, the Bane, it's called. Yeah. Something like, in Spain, stains mainly on plane, something like that. Imagine if they, if they did, like, uh, a mod for Resident Evil to include those voices when shooting. <laughs> You'd get double the annoyance.
Oh, you blind fuck. Yes, use the key card. Or card key. <laughs> Hall side doors locked. The doors can be unlocked by a card key. Will you use the blue card key? Checking checking up ID card. Dot dot dot. Even the computers use ellipses here, just Oh, that was four dots. That's one, like one level more of assholeness. No zombies up there. Whole side doors. Lock released. Alright. So we have another safe room here. I mean, half of the safe room is the hole, and the other half is, well, this. I kind of feel like you go... Like you do the... Oh, jeez, there are zombies here now? Screw you. Oh. That's right. Still alive? No, no, down, Leon. You don't shoot above them. It's just silly. Always looking f to the furthest guy. Police memorandum. That's the same as yesterday. That's how I knew the code. So the code changes depending on which route you took, like Leon A or Claire A, and that defines the what the code will be. What, you can't see him? Oh, that's just lovely. Down, boy, down! Down, boy! It's a down. Oh, Jesus, he's getting up. Are you serious? Bulletproof fucks. And there's another one. Lovely. Not in my eaten mouth. Mm. Mm. <laughs> this guy's this guy's surprised. Like, oh, he's shooting at me. Mm. <laughs> okay, these are some weird zombies. They're all weird fucks requiring so much ammo. I'm gonna unlock this one, even though I think I shouldn't do that first. But what the hell? Just so I don't forget. This one here. What do we find? Shells! Okay, no, it's okay. I'm glad I did it. More shells are always welcome. I know uh, the, the, the lock desk on the second floor houses uh, pistol upgrade. So Leon has, doesn't have three different ammo types, but he's got uh, different He's got upgrades for board, both the shotgun and the pistol, and that... And the magnum, actually. You can also upgrade the magnum. And that makes it super... Is there a liquor here? No? Super cool. Especially the upgraded magnum. I think my favorite is the shotgun, though. Because it kind of goes... Um, even... With Leon holding it, so it's not clear, you can't say it, like she's lighter or whatever. Um, there's a knockback that just pushes him away. No liquors here, at least, right? All right, all the locks are the same, I, I believe. Yeah, spade or a spade, another herb. I have the lighter for the first virgin heart. Picking up virgin hearts and not breaking them. No one here, only the grabbers, I suppose. So it's been so long, and since Claire didn't want to let them touch her, they're gonna try and grab Leon, I suppose. Oh, jeez, just fucking run past them. Fuck those guys. Maybe that was a bad idea, I'm gonna be surrounded by two zombies. When I get out, but maybe not. That did scare me, I forgot about that. Oh! A recent accident, yeah, yeah, yeah. Where's the... There should be a file here, right? Come on, Liam. Or is that just in the first scenario? 
some item locations are different. Thanks for the spark, Sydney. Appreciate it. And the strawberry. <laughs> I get it. Okay, there it is. It was there instead. So it's the same operation report. David Ford. The same one that we got in the in the last campaign, only here it was moved. I guess when Claire read it, she was like, ah, oh, fuck that, just do it up on the desk. Cool, 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 cool. Okay. A sacrifice to the hellfire. Burn the witch! Burn! And that chick managed to poop out two virgin hearts out of her back somehow. In one night. It's gotta be some talent. Okay, now we know we have a virgin heart. And where's that ammo? I was. Yeah, I knew there was some ammo. Um, really? How about shotgun shells? It's probably in the A scenario. But Claire doesn't find anything there, but Leon does. It's kind of balanced in a good way. Choo -choo -choo -choo. Nothing special, I guess that's it. We'll pillage this room good. Is that all? No EX files? Okay, I will really, really need to remember to look up on the internet where all of the EX files in the B scenario are. Because even though I didn't believe, I, I managed to get them on in the A scenario, I was sure I missed one until the end. But here, I can't really say anything. There could be any, anywhere. Sometimes you don't even see them. You just go around pressing A, hoping you'll be like, oh, this paper has something interesting written on it. Let's read it. It's not gonna glitter like most items. Where are you looking, Leon? Sometimes it seems like he's... No, that's me turning. Sometimes it looks like he's trying to look at some something specific. Should have equipped the shotgun off. Yep. Let's take one head off. Yeah. The other guy doesn't even acknowledge me. You just stay there, guy. Oh yeah. Okay, let's hope that four shells will be enough. Whoo we. No one here. That's that's good news. All right, and two herbs, double. All right. Okay, okay. Now I can go. I should have gone to the to the floor first. Yeah, because I need that key. Like wherever I want to go, if I want to connect the offices, I need that key. So I'll go back to. Could have avoided that, but okay. But just some bad planning. And we need a special key for that, which we don't have. So, screw that. Cool, so much ammo. Wow, I forgot that. I was sure I'll be, I'll be running with like three bullets, one saved for me. The operation report two. Elliot Edward, that was the police officer who got killed by the Chopper, he accidentally crashed on himself. That was him. And that's the same guy that in the remake of Resident Evil 2 gets killed off at the uh, shutters, gets split in half. It's really a gruesome scene. Not advised if you have a weak heart. But then again, if you're watching a Resident Evil 2 stream, I suppose you're good with that. One virgin heart, two virgin heart. Okay, let's reload the shotgun. Just so we always have it. Prepared. Pistol ammo, shotgun ammo. There we go. That is so comforting. Mm -mm. Nothing here before we find the film. I wonder if we can find Sexy Wesky's 
secret film in B scenario. Hey, a lot of this is discovery for me as well. Well, discovery for me, period. Twelve ink ribbons. Ribbons. Or ribbons. Suck on that. People who save, who actually save their game and don't risk getting a game over screen. I am better than all of you. <laughs> Until something just snaps my spine in two. Start too dark to see the nemesis that's that's lurking in the shadows. Oh yeah, he's he's not, he's somewhere around town chasing Jill around this time. Because this the the Resident Evil 2 happens a, a bit before. Actually, Resident Evil 3 happens a bit before and then a bit after Resident Evil 2. So the first part before Jill gets infect infected by Nemesis. Oh, he's dead already. That was easy. That part is um, has already happened. And while Leon and Claire are doing this... Um, no grabby grabby? No? Okay. Uh, Jill is now asleep. And in like a day or two, uh, they're gonna bombed Raccoon City, but Claire and Leon obviously survive because they escape. And Jill escapes in the last moment, not suffering any radiation sickness or anything, being that close to the blast in that chopper, but we're not going to talk about that. Hello, safe room. Well, half of the safe room. Wait, where's, there's some file here. Office, yeah, that's where we want to get. Marvin, you don't even... Wow! Wait, hold on. Yeah, I know this angle, but what's this? I didn't... I don't remember this angle. How is that even possible? So I know that. Then we can go here, really, and actually see. Look at that, there's a wanted poster on the left. Fucking kidding me. So this is where like clients were, would come to report their neighbors. He kicked my dog. His dog pissed on my lawn. Stuff like that. No invisible ammo. You sure, Leon? Double check that. You're a cop. Come on. What about this statue? There's an office now. Not the office. The statue, you blind fuck. Okay. You should really stop insulting him. Maybe he'd listen to me more. Hooey! Okay, we have enough help. We have enough ammo. We have many drop frames for some reason. That's not the best of things, but okay. So there's that. There's a whole horde on the right. And I wonder what... Oh, let me... Let me... Yeah, I'm gonna... I have to inspect that before coming here. So... Four spots. Should be able to take, take a few of the horde zombies before. Um, and still have some ammo left. So. Oh, jeez, that's not good. Okay, kill the first guy. That guy, ru run. Okay, or get chomped a bit. That's okay, you can take it like a man. Then run towards them and just. Bwah! That's the spirit. Now just culturally, you know, politely shoot the fuck out of them. No, no. Down, boy. Down, I say. Down. 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 Okay, that's not bad. One chomp and still fine. I don't know how far he is. Okay, there he is. That's a good shotgun. Like, killed. Two of them with one blast, the other one needed just one more bullet, shell, actually bullet from the pistol. And then this guy was finished off easily, and then the last guy had just fallen. And they're all done. That was a lot easier than expected. And we're fine, we have three shells, which should be enough for two hunters, uh, lickers. So-so, if they line up perfectly. It will be. Is there a file here? Let's see. 
as an office. But so this is another waiting room for probably different affairs, different citizen affairs. Same writing, nothing is wrong. What you don't want to pick up anything to eat or drink? You too. Like I had this conversation with Claire. It's not healthy. You're running around, nothing to care about. Such emo. So sadness. Running around, wasting energy and not eating, that is really immature of you, Leon. For, even for a rookie cop. Huh. Okay, there might be a minor horde in this hallway. If there is a minor horde of liquors, I'll just turn my butt toward I don't hear anything. Nothing here. Okay, that's good to know. That's for the hard key. I think there's gonna be a liquor straight inside. Oh, and the green herb has been moved. For clear, it was all the way in the back of the uh, hole. The first red herb not to be wasted under any circumstances. It's worth more than a kidney in, the, in these games. So let's prepare for a shotgun wedding. I hope there's a, there are some items inside, because if there aren't, just wasted resources. Hello, Licky. Will you fall down? Yeah, that's what I like to see. Wow, that missed again. But too soon? Is that the thing? Hopefully he doesn't. Just yeah. not bad, not bad. When a shell misses like that, it really hurts me. So I have to wait that precise millisecond after they're back back on their feet in order to get them that's really that's annoying as fuck and if you wait too long you're gonna get killed so come on Leon there's something on the table I can see it are you blind you're hurt I see but not in your eyes a magic mirror yeah what's on the table on the table man just look at the table Oh, there's nothing. Okay, that's not a file. It's a false file. It looks like a file. That's on Tony's arms, at least. Looks like there's a... Is that a typewriter there? Maybe it was supposed to be a safe room at some point. No X files here, huh? How many do we have so far? Oh, it saved all of the all of Claire's EX files, and now we also have Leon's. So that's two out of eight. I'll check one once more. Keep pressing A around the tables. Sometimes it just works. Hey, liquor. Have you gotten this file? Hmm. Hmm. Talk to me, come on, talk to me. God damn it, man. First you want to take my head off, then you're all silent. Moody bastard. You might have just swallowed the file and be like, fuck you, Leon, you're gonna kill me, I'm gonna eat your reading material. You can't watch the TV, there's a magic mirror. Uh, once more this corner, maybe. Okay, I guess I was wrong. At least that's cleaned up, cleaned up, and we have a a new like a. Why am I so slow? We have a new box of uh, pistol bullets, which is welcome. Any kind of ammo is like give it here. You can't even use yeah, I'll just throw it at them. I don't mind. Give me grenade rounds, even though, although I don't have a grenade launcher, I'll just throw grenade rounds at them. Be like, ah, take that. Pray to God they ignite on the on their own and stuff like that. Oh, there's more herbs in that office. I forgot. Yeah. So to the left, it's fast. Yeah, I need to pull the stick all the way. That's why for turning, it's better to use the D-pad. I just wish the N64 controller had a better solution to like 
still have to do this all the time. It's kind of tiring, but it kind of also feels like um, uh, like you know losing time to reload your weapon and stuff like that, which from what I understand Capcom wanted to do. Oh, again, me looking for files that were probably not there. That's the most important thing, you know, fuck everything else. Files. Files are what we're looking for. Uh, deep that again. Give me a herb. A herb of life. Life. Okay. Fine and dandy again. Nothing special hidden here. We'll open that, but still, yeah, there's nothing there, nothing here. Some memos look like they can be picked up, but they can't. Like this here. Yeah, I tried that. Okay, let's do something more fun. Like kill some zombies. Or just like... Find a way out of here. Meet Ada. Go out on a date. Watch Ada leave you. <laughs> Feel destroyed inside. All those fun things. That's right, Leon. You're a good boy. Hello, endless box. Bottomless, even. This can go straight there along with this and this. I'm carrying an emergency fiber plan. I'm gonna do this because it's so badass. Come closer to the camera. Yeah. Closer, not further away. Like that, yeah. Uh. Invis invisible shells, here we come. Just a lamb or shotgun ammo. Could have. Uh, could have fit one of the the virgin hearts, but let's find the the other one at first. One we on one. Oh, that's really good that the ladder was already. I forgot the ladder was already down, which is like a left over from where when Claire passed. So, but they kind of did it backwards both here and in the remake. Because I feel that the, you know, the one that's closer to the station is the B side. And that seems to do everything after the A side, which just doesn't make sense. I don't know how far they are, but I'm brave enough to check. At least backwards. Oh no, there they are. Okay, let's find a good angle. Keep them a bit occupied. Oh, that guy fell down quick. Just... Oh! Some of the shell uh, pellets must have caught him. Because he died from like two bullets. So the shotgun is really... It pays off. Even without the upgrade. It, it's the third guy. Fourth guy. <laughs> this is not giving up. All right. And there's the metal. It's so silly on scenario B. It's like right there. But I guess... I don't know how it got moved for scenario A. We can guess. We can play these guessing games. Like, what do you think happened in this room? For scenario A, a and for scenario B. 
Go down the ladder, show them who's the boss. Use the metal on the waiting lady. I like how his steps are, footsteps are giving him a nice beat. I think it's the same description. <laughs> A really unnecessary cutscene by today's standards, but back then it was these were treasured, like even even something like this. Like I guess it was a to go around the technical limitation of making the statue to be actually a polygon and move. You don't see anything different now, but in the FMV it moved, so you know it counts. Otherwise it would have have to been it would have to been uh an actual polygon and probably reduce the poly count or the size of the room maybe because this is one fucking large room. <clears throat> so spade key. Let's reload the shotgun. Always keep keep five shells on like that. Pistol ammo, shotgun ammo. And unlock the doors. My favorite kind of scary doors. The ones that have the, the like six. Hmm, what's here? Six ribs or whatever. You sure? Because you seem to be finding a lot more ammo than I remember, so. Especially invisible one. Both be oh, there's a sign here that I never. Some room. Some something. So I'm guessing this was just an employee uh, path, and not for the police station clients. Just one, huh? So I basically, probably could have gotten from the other side to hallway. I don't know. Okay, there must be some super secret file here now. Patrol report, that's the same. Although we won't use C4 at all. Okay, nothing there. Nothing here. Should be an ink ribbon or something here, I think. Maybe even a file. Files on the only company in the city. I think there was an EX file here in the, in Claire scenario in A, but uh, Leon has is having some trouble finding it. No worries, Leon. Don't let. Keep your spirits up. You'll find it, boy. here yeah I'll check that on the web I have to try I have to try that's something I like doing so but for the purpose of the stream and also that it's it ties really well into Resident Evil 3 these files I feel are more important than just your regular files there must be something else here you can't tell me that's the only thing that doesn't make sense. Okay, I know the crank isn't there, but just an FA spray, a key for that, that is silly. And just one door key, so you could just go the whole game without even opening this room. If you want to speed run or something. Ridiculous. Don't be ridiculous. Don't be ridiculous. Yeah. Oh, well, maybe it's here. Jeez. Seriously, that's it? I like how it starts reading like mid-camera change, like this. I guess nothing. Investigation reports are mean nothing to a rookie police officer who could have gotten some info about what's going on from them. 
who am I to talk? I don't know what's your best option, Leon, but I'm I'm on your side. If you don't want to read, you don't want to read. I'll understand that. Let's go do something else. Spending so much time in one room, wow. What's the situation over there, Sasha? Well, busy as always. Busy as always. Well, as in the last week or so. Maybe, I'm just, uh, I have a theory, maybe it has something to do with the uh, chat only option. You think? No, just, okay, I I'll guess. Sasha's trying to get us into the small streamers raffle to be hosted, which we got uh, last week four, five times in a row. Wow! And this week, when I'm doing Re there, there were some party games and stuff like that. But this week, we're doing Resident Evil 2, and we can't get a single one. This is the fourth day, right? Yeah. We want to spread the word. Look at me playing Resident Evil. If you're you know, if you don't like playing that game but want to know the story or just want to watch a guy play a game, here I am. Come find me. Do I need something up there? No, not the wall, not nothing. Not nothing, nothing, nothing at all. About 12% drop frames, which isn't bad, it's 110. Hey, stop demolishing my studio, woman. I am so sorry. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay, I'll get it. I'm not sure where it went. Oh, it probably fell down or behind. Oh, there it is. Yeah. Slowly and politely <laughs> pick it up. Nothing here. Oh, is that the second virgin heart? Then we can open the virgin chest thingy. Yeah, okay. Their gaze upon me, blah 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 blah. I am a narcissist, blah blah blah. Nar narcissist? Is that the English expression? Narcissist. That's so, that's so so strange to say. You just say a narcissist. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So what was the deal? If we do the well either either one. It's easier to push this one here twice like that. And approach from this side and be like, mm, you pass it because that's that was a test. I was just testing you, and then you push it for real. Like I said, for real, Leon. Come on, Leon. What's your dude? Are you serious? What the hell? Why is he not pushing? Okay, let's push it. Maybe it's like he can't push no more. One more. Nope. You just lost the ability to push for some reason. Let's try this one. I'm using the D-pad now. Yeah, okay. I don't know what that was. But... Jeez. Can you do it? Alright. I hope that one didn't glitch in. Never seen that happen before. God of Sun has been set. Now let's check God of Moon. What are you doing, God of Moon? It's there. It should work. What the hell happened? Is that it? Oh, God. Thank you. Probably because it was hitting the, the edge of the statue. I don't know. Yeah, but it's got enough room to for him to squeeze in yeah I think the god of moon was the one used in the library in the first Resident Evil God the sound is beautiful in this version I mean it sounds like shit because of all the complexion but the surround is magnificent for such an old game and it even works with headphones, which usually you have to, like in these surround games, especially modern ones, you have to set like your 
speaker configuration so the game knows how to divide the sound for you let's try and get more of them now like this he still chomped me god and i'm hurt thanks a lot asshole i hope you're happy i have to hold my wow oh. Oh, he just keeps on coming. So, yeah, whoever I missed, the pellets got them from far. I love that. That's not gonna happen with the bowgun. I see why people don't like the bowgun. It's more like a concentrated spread weapon. It's okay. I don't think the tyrant's gonna attack soon. Star sharpish. So I'm gonna go check this. Check the star's office for everything I can find. Wow, listen to that music. Anything here? Nothing suspicious or out of the ordinary. Yeah, yeah. They're um... already. Fuck yeah, thank you. You find a lot later with scenario B. I mean, with Leon A. So we already have the Desert Eagle. Um, which is the most powerful weapon in the game next to the rocket launcher. And we will be able to upgrade it later. To make it even more powerful. Is he gonna find some spray? Rookie's desk, yeah. I didn't find, I remember there was, oh, there's another EX file. See, it was, in, it was invisible. So EX file number nine, Rebecca's report. Uh, in the in scenario A, we found a file which uh, connected the story to code Veronica mentioning the Ashford family and all that and this one actually connects it to um, Resident Evil Zero which was supposed to be released on the N64 but was uh, later pushed to GameCube because of its complexity so here we go Rebecca I can't do Rebecca's voice voice but I'll do my best <clears throat> on July 23rd an MP vehicle was found inside the Arkley Mountains. Maybe something squeakier. Corpses of MP members and an unidentified body were found near the vehicle. According to the information from military authorities, the, un the unidentified body was identified as former ensign Billy Cohen, who was sentenced to death penalty following a court martial on July 22nd. Everything was ha everything happened so close. While Cohen was on transfer via a Navy MP escort, they must have experienced some sort of accident. The corpses were severely, severely mauled, apparently torn apart by unidentified wild animals. The following day, we returned to their location to recover the bodies, but they were nowhere to be found. Military authorities have requested that we hand over Cohen's body as proof of his death, but due to the circumstances described above, it will be a difficult task to recover the car corpse. I am requesting that this case be temporarily closed until further notice. Raccoon City Police Department stars off a team Rebecca Chambers. Or, as the intro guy says it, Rebecca Chambers. Do you strain yourself while doing that or does it come naturally? What, like this? Yep. Yeah, I can do high-pitched voices. Probably <laughs> even better if I practice. Oh, thanks for the follow. Um, Alizy, 001. James Von Colleague. Haha. -ha. Alright, Rebecca's report has been filed. That's another EX file. Three out of eight. Good. Well, where's my FI spray? Not that I will use it, I just want to show it off. Be like, look at look at me, I have five unused FI sprays. How many do you have? My mom bought me more FI sprays than your mom bought for you. It's Chris's desk. Jill's possible boyfriend, which we never find out about, I think. 
Quesh's diary. That's the same. So I'm not gonna read that. That's the same as it was in the uh, in a scenario. So that's how Leon finds out. He's like, "Fuck." And I guess I'm, I'm gonna imagine them like reading files and leaving them there, which at least Leon, as a cop, should be, you know. Oh, we need to. We need this shit as proof or something, but. And Jill already took the ammo in Resident Evil 3, so nothing here for us. What? Useful on the shelf. Is there anything useful here? No. Where all that's left is, I think, Sexy Wesky's diary. Or maybe some kind of ammo in the corner. Yeah! Alright, secret ammo is always welcome. We can see the star members, all of them. Such a nice detail. And they look like... I'm not sure if that's the cast, the uh, human, like, live-action cast from the first movie or <laughs> first game, or the models, but... Okay, that's for Chris's marksmanship, and... Shekshiweshkizdash is about to get ransacked. One... Ten. Twenty. Thirty. Forty. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Okay, I missed one. But still. Yeah. Got the film. The perv film. Can't do anything with this without it being developed, so I'm gonna go back down there and... Is the fax gonna go off now? For him as well? Not sure. Let's try and leave the room. Nope, it's just for the A scenario. So not all the files are the same. Most of them are, but not all. Now let's go back to the dark room before we proceed any further, because we have many safe rooms, you know, and item boxes, but it's the only room where we can actually develop film. Go back to the stick. Jeez, my hand hurts from the D-pad. That's just silly. Silly, silly. Louie. I <laughs> had to load that one scene before opening the door. Let's heal ourselves. So, this is where Magnum goes. And that's where the other Virgin Heart goes. And this is where... The Green Herb goes, Mon. Yeah, my Rastafarian accent is probably very bad. Oh, use that film. <laughs> Is it the same? Yeah, it's the same picture. Just Rebecca doing her basketball. Staring at the camera? I don't know. Wesker, you perv. Okay, let's go meet Sherry from, or should I say Sherry, from Claire's A scenario. I gathered this is going to be the, the hallway is going to be their meeting place, not the, the star's office we were just in. Is there some hidden ammo here? Can never have enough ammo. Nope. 
Nope. Nope. Maybe here. Nope. Okay. She should be here now. Oh, I didn't recharge or reload the shotgun. There it is. Hey, wait! Wow, that's new for me. Leon B scenario is really, really unfamiliar. I can't stress that enough. And she left something. That was kind of her. The purple key. Why did she have it? Can somebody tell me? So we got the diamond key from Sherry here. Wow, that is... That's really nice. I mean, I like how you have effectively four campaigns here and they all have something different. So it's not the same thing over and over again. And there's Claire, I suppose. Leon. Yep. I didn't hear it coming in this time too, so Claire, you made it. Yeah. Have you seen a little girl around here? See, it makes a lot more sense in this than in the remake. Yeah, you just missed her. Who is she? I don't know. But it's too dangerous for her to stay here alone. Leon, I'll go look for her. You go and find us a way out of here. Of course. But before I forget, here's a radio. That way we can keep in touch if something comes up. Okay. I'll go look for her. You go and find us a way out of here. He's gonna stay silent even in his own scenario. Well, okay, Liam. Double deal from you. Doo -doo -doo. And now I don't have the small key to open the... Uh, to get the pistol upgrade, but I don't mind because I really needed those shotgun shells. They were really necessary. And like four liquors are dead. Thanks for the spark, Khaleesi. I appreciate it. Very much. Oh, yeah, it's happening. Shit's hitting the fan, or rather the shutter that was closed. So if I close the other shutter, would they have flooded in on the other hole in the other hallway where I don't have to go through I wonder so many questions after so many years of playing that's why this game is so good I mean many reasons why this game is so good but that's definitely one of them what profiling investigation well you could learn something there Leon or find a secret EX file there should be somewhere in this library None of the books appear to be useful. Umbrella Inc. Umbrella Inc. The only company in town aside from uh, Kendo's Gun Shop and let's not forget Aru... Uh, what's it called? Aruka's Tailor. Okay, anything here? You're not even gonna comment on that? No? Okay. Let's solve the... I'm gonna say puzzle. It's kind of puzzle. Mm, chemistry. More chemistry. More chemistry. Well, that ties in neatly with Umbrella's plans. Is that chemistry too? Yeah. And what about here? Is there the... Nope. Nothing here. Really? Well, Claire found one there, and I know you find it with Leon A. So, yeah, the location of EX files are uh, mostly different, more than anything else. I'm gonna fall through any second now. Oh, not yet, okay. Bah! At least that doesn't scare me anymore. It happened so many times, it's ridiculous. Don't be ridiculous. <laughs> okay, I think the code is the same as for the A scenario. First, fourth, sixth. Yeah, it's the same code. Just make them all symmetrical. So move this one. 
to the right and this one as well and that's it now we get a plug so Leon's not collecting stone slabs like Claire he's collecting uh, plugs because he's gonna go to the to the door of the guy who designed the I don't even know how to explain it there was a diary about the watchman who was playing poker with this no actually chess with this uh, person who works in the sewage uh, treatment plant and he designed a special lock and key for for the sewers which basically works on um, full using these uh, plugs so you need four of them and they are all chest themed surprise surprise maybe there's something behind the shelves i should check i mean it's not impossible in fact it's entirely possible something here maybe Leon? no what about here? Oh, I have to move them again? Uh, that's just ridiculous. Nothing here. Let's move that one as well. Maybe something pops up behind one of them? No? Okay. Again, a lot of mixed memories from the remake. Hey, even, yeah, I didn't know that. Even these shelves reset. Everyone back to their places thing. Didn't know that. Never actually had, had to go back and do anything with them. Because that's the only thing you need them for. Stones for Claire, plugs for Leon, and you're done. There might be a liquor up there, but I know for sure there's going to be a tyrant. One sec. Or maybe not with her. Yeah, it's the, maybe he's gonna bust in. I have no idea what I'm doing in the Leon B scenario, actually. I, everything I know about the B scenario is based on Claire's B scenario. And I don't think that Leon needs to go back there to face the tyrant, so he might attack me in the prison below. Oh, look, we have that. I didn't even know where I picked him up. Um, there you go here, let's use these and com actually combine this. We have two red green herbs now, that's good news. Let's stockpile them for the final confrontation. Okay, we have those, no liquors should return. So far, so good. Let's do a few more things for today. Like use these. You can hear the wind from the broken ceiling window. So many really really good small touches that make it just so make it a good game so this is me turning with the d-pad this is me turning with the stick either like that or like that but that really requires some strength but if i keep holding b it's not much different it is actually i think he does speed up a little but he definitely does that when running and the Tyranus chest is wide open. Mommy, mommy, why is that madman opening his chest? Another plug. So things are moving faster now. And we have the purple key. Purple nurple key. Wait, if I have the diamond key, diamond key opens two doors. 
One of them will have the tyrant or the liquor, I know that. Or maybe not me. He's gonna wait for me on another spot. Let's drop the plug and go check the first floor western side for the diamond lock. And then do the same on the east. So we have the bishop and the king. Well, they can go right next to this. Probably gonna have a small key there as well. Pretty sure. For now, let's do. <laughs> no. Just in case. I don't think there will be more than two items in the inter inter interrogation rooms. All the moans in the background. What is going on there? Oh. Holy shit, why are you back? Who the fuck? Why? Oh, why? I can avoid you? Fuck you. I have my dignity. Are they back in the hallway as well? Hope not. That was unexpected. You think you're doing something smart, then the game one-ups you. It goes like, ah, you're not gonna do that. I have a trap for you. Okay. Lose a few seconds, really. Doesn't last too long. A few... Like 30 seconds a minute to run around. You know what would be cute? If they put the liquors on the floor now, which they didn't. Okay. That's just for the A scenario. Okay. Sounds so good. They're like more than funny. Okay, you can stop. I'm gonna end the stream soon in about 10 to 20 -ish min minutes, as soon as I complete these few goals. If the big guy busts in, I have the shotgun and one big health. Diamond key used, and is there a liquor inside? Hopefully not. Okay, is something gonna bust through the the window again? Let's not take the plug. Just explore the room first a bit. Nothing here. Holy shit! So, oh god! Screw you, buddy. No, I shot first. Oh, I was good. It scared me real good. I wonder if maybe I shouldn't have walked in the first time. 
I don't know if it still has two liquors. That scared me good. It switches things around. That's really good. That's why I'm playing this game. <sighs> to get scared shitless. Wow. <laughs> I expected him to do that after I pick up the the plug. Yeah. Not the spray. So that's a nice detail. Woo wee. And no files to read. Why did I come here? Just for the plug? Yeah, that's kind of... It clashes with what I remember about the game. Yeah. But yeah, I know I said it like 50 times during the stream. I just haven't played both of the, the scenarios. I haven't played the Claire A, B, uh, Liam B scenario as much because I'm always like, I wanna, you know, wanna do the the, the, the one that's not canon first and then I just forget, and then I do it again and again, and never actually get to do the canon scenario. The glass is gone. Yeah, the, nothing's different. Good game, wow, you, you're succeeding at making me shit my pants. Poop my pants, poop them. <laughs> There's something about the fixed camera angle, something... Um, yeah, you can't see as much, but again, you can see much more than you can in the remakes. The remake, uh, actually. Because Resident Evil 1 remake uses the same principle. Okay, let's do it like this. And let's go get the purple. The second purple thing. You ready for more liquors then? And I'm in need of a small key. So, okay, there are some first aid sprays. It's not all bad. Uh, the tyrant's not gonna be there yet. Maybe again. I have no idea. So I'm gonna just keep gonna carrying all this shit with me. I'm gonna discard the key as soon as I use it anyway. So yeah, it's the same room with the same key. Okay, so didn't, they didn't invade this room, that's good. Hallway rather. But they did invade the other one where I'll need to go. Hoo-hoo! No grabby grabby? Okay. the shotgun or the pistol. I'll check. As soon as they walk inside, I'll know what I'm facing. Hopefully it's not the tyrant. Nothing. Okay. Big hunk of nothing. Any files here for Leon? We have a film. That's appreciated. Okay, anything here, Leon? Search carefully. Nope. Maybe in this pile? Yeah, we checked that already. Nope. What about here? Okay, lock's broken, cannot be opened. That's for Claire. What about this one? 
Right. So pretty much we're always good. Pretty much always with the uh, with the ammo, <clears throat> the shotgun ammo. Well, and pistol ammo too. Look at that. So this, you know, survival isn't as hard as I expected it to be. But it's still pretty scary. Let's get both of these guys with a shotgun show. If possible, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Save an ammo, that's my game. He's dead, okay. And those guys are dead. He's still alive. No. I like how they back up like, Stay away, you maniac! I'm sorry, this is Leon. Stay away, you maniac! Is that all of them? Is that Marvin? Or is that somebody who attacked Marvin? And why are they all there? If like Claire was there and there was no one when I mean when they first talk. But now it's full of zombies. Come on, you bulletproof bastard. Okay, he's dead, Jim. A couple of zombies and all the ammo is down to a minimum. Oh, Marvin's missing. And we have a small key. Okay, time to... Oh, it's just a... It's just the hard key. So that's why it said the key is in the eastern office. Was it? It's in the opposite office. Yeah, in the western office. One of the files said that. And I'm not sure if that applies only to this scenario. Kind of makes sense. Then who moved it? Like, did Leon leave it for Claire at another spot? What's the thing? I'm asking so many questions. I shouldn't. Somebody from Capcom will come by and pop a cap in my ass. Okay. Is there a file we can read, Leon? No. Okay. Okay. Is there a lying zombie? No. this Michael festival after the mayor of Raccoon City nothing really wow I feel like yeah it's not like I feel it was it happened so when playing the a scenario we got seven of the eight files really fast and then the last one was at the end of the game but now it's a bit different this is the same More bullets, yes, always. What's that? Small key? Fuck. Okay, the, no. The, the save room is, I mean, the, the safe room is right behind <laughs> one wall to the east, so to the south, actually. Oh, thanks for the follow, Contour Sh Sean or Scene. I'm gonna go with Sean. The double scary door. And the endless box. Oh, I didn't develop the film. Okay, I'll go back. And the heart key. There. Don't need it for now, though I don't have anything else. Anything better to put in, so... 20 shells, just in case the pesky tyrant decides to just burst through the walls, that would be unbelievably uncomfortable, so... So, yeah... Okay, I need to go that way anyway to... Um, 
get the second floor pistol upgrade it's gonna make things a lot easier because it's got the burst fire mode you can do like pa 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 three bullets at once especially good for like liquors if you're left with nothing but the pistol and faced with liquors that's your solution the waiting room no ex files it really is disappointing that i can't find them as easy One more scary door and we're in the dark room. We're counting distance in this game by the number of scary doors we need to go through. Not actual real world measurements because they're pretty much useless. In terms of the game, like that's like 50 meters away or I don't know, 150 million feet. Doesn't mean anything here. Just how many scary doors you have to get to their place. How many scary doors did you have to go through, Claire, when you got to this room? Well, it was four. Okay, I know how far that is. Film B is the same. <coughs> Pardon me. I'll just get the pistol upgrade and I think... Save. Before going to basement, I'm going to save and end today's session. I think that would be the wisest choice. All right. And this is where Sherry escaped when we saw her last. I was disappointed when I played, sorry, because I played Resident Evil 3 first, then 1, then 2. I was disappointed to see how little of police station you actually see in 3. Just like up to this point, everything else is barricaded. That's a little, you know, weak because these doors are barricaded. And some of the doors, like in the lower hallways, they have been cut off by uh, tables and stuff like that, so I get it, yeah, they moved that, that makes sense. But what about all the other doors, like th this one here that I just went through? Uh, they they were literally like, they had like wood wooden barricades on them. So it doesn't make sense to me to just like remove that and it looks so fresh. But they tried to, like you know, retcon it the best they could. And here we go, ladies and gentlemen. The first upgrade for Leon S. Kennedy. They look like parts for a gun. I mean, coming from a police officer, that's not really... <sighs> the world I'm trying to do is... Uh, find is... Wow, I'm tired. Uh... Consolidating. Comforting. Comforting. Wow. Brain fart. So now we have an HAK... The H and K VP70 burst with a stock holster, so it can go pop, 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 or you can just change it to manual in a single bullet. We'll go with auto because most of the time I'll need it. And it's got this cool stock now. See, he always has it. So it kind of lessens the recoil. Really neat. So first upgrade. Next, we have upgrades for Shotgun and Magnum, which don't come till very late in the game. Maybe I should have gotten out... Ah, it doesn't matter. Actually, it does. What am I saying? It would be a lot faster than to, you know, go down the whole route. Gotta remember to pick up the hard key, and that's it. We're ready for the next session after that. I still want to know where those EX files are. How many do we have? Three, I think, three or four? Well, yeah, I haven't explored uh, the floor yet. Let's do that first. The third floor or second, depending on if you count the ground floor as first or not. So... 
there a tyrant here or liquor? No one. Oh, -ho! I'm unstoppable. But I still don't have the crank. I don't think I can do anything here. At least I can explore. Aha, uh -huh, I was wrong. Once you get the police station map, you get the police station map. It's not first floor, second floor, like in the first game. So yeah, we had the map all along. So as you can see, first floor is pretty much done. We have two club doors and the hard door we're about to open. And the second floor has two more unlocked. Where is that? Huh. Oh, yeah, okay, that's where only Claire would enter, so Leon's not gonna check those holes anyway. They're, they're where the uh, chief of police is, so... Fuck that guy. Is there a crank here? No, just a square hole. A square hole. Rusted gear. Nothing peculiar. I mean, I understand Claire, but you're not gonna take any of those tools to bash someone's head in. That's just bad planning. You're a bad cop. I don't know how you get to protect President's daughter after this. Like, he survived. He must be a good candidate. I mean, he survived that as well. The Las Plagas uh, crisis. So I guess they were kind of right. No jumpy jumpy from the tyrant? No. It feels like Claire gets attacked more often by the tyrant, but... I want to call no trouble. Maybe Leon's just gonna do it all later. And the bosses are gonna be different, I know that. So he won't fight a G baby, a G adult. He's gonna fight Honest to God William right away, I think, as the first boss. He's gonna pick up a, one of the. Um, what are they called? <gasps> no, wait, maybe Leon goes through here. I don't know. Claire should like call him and be like, yeah, I cleared the wreckage. I'll try and come back, you know. Once we have that conversation, because I never tried that. I mean, in all honesty, I think only once I've played a Leon B scenario, and that's all. That's it. So it's going to be interesting to play it multiple times now. And this is our final destination for today, ladies and gentlemen. The safe room right here. Because I want to be safe, I'm going to bring these. Leave inventory as is. That's it. No magnum. That's. Oh, don't want to waste that yet. And let's save. Yes. Put it on seven. We have, I think, fifteen. Yeah. waiting room and that was episode one of Leon B scenario of Resident Evil 2 for the N64 so many words in there join me tomorrow for uh, part two of Leon B scenario same channel same time you can find me on Facebook uh, Instagram Twitter and YouTube as Hippy Tesla just like below my face cam only on Instagram you'll have to add an underscore between Hippie and Tesla thanks for watching and until next time Stay safe.